Looking ahead now, Pfizer and BioNTech say they will seek emergency use approval for their coronavirus vaccine today. Earlier this week, companies reported its vaccine candidate 95% effective. The application and clinical trial data will be reviewed by an independent board of scientists before that approval is granted. 12 News reporter Alexander Leslie has been following these developments all week long. Alex, how quickly could vaccines be shipped following an approval? Well, the chief operation officer for Operation Warp Speed says once that emergency use authorization comes, vaccines will be distributed as soon as 24 hours later, and they'll be ready to administer. Now, as we've reported, Rhode Island was chosen by Pfizer to take part in a pilot vaccine delivery program. It doesn't mean Rhode Island gets the vaccine sooner, but the program is to help refine a plan for the delivery, deployment, and administration of the vaccine. At a White House Coronavirus Task Force briefing, yesterday, Dr. Anthony Fauci said the speed in which these vaccines are being developed did not compromise safety or scientific integrity. It was a reflection of the extraordinary scientific advances in these types of vaccines, which allowed us to do things in months that actually took years before. So I really want to settle that concern that people have about that. And Massachusetts-based Moderna is also planning to apply for emergency use approval for its COVID-19 vaccine in the coming weeks. The company reported earlier this week that its vaccine was 94.5% effective. Live in Pawtucket, Alexandra Leslie, 12 News.